Has sister wives, Mary Brown, been catfished again? Who's catfishing who at this point? Hello and welcome back to Tea with Trishy. Back in 2014, Mary and Cody divorced so that Cody could marry Robin so he could legally adopt Robin's kids. Then in March of 2015, Mary was catfished. What does it mean to be catfished? Catfishing is a deceptive activity where a person creates a fictional persona on a social networking service, usually targeting a specific victim and may be used for financial gain. So in March of 2015, after Mary divorced Cody, she met Sam on social media. His full name is Samuel Jacob Cooper. Based on Sam's website, he is a dad of five beautiful kids, son Trey, Heston and Alex, his twin boys, and daughters, Peace and Sky, with two angel babies in heaven named Ryan and Talon. He is a divorced, semi-retired app developer, business partner, commercial real estate investor, vegan, lifelong Catholic, voting independent party member, a guitar playing singer who owns a dog and three cats. They all live happily in Denver, Colorado. Mary fell hard for Sam. Based on these facts, I don't know about you, but he seems too good to be true to me. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Just reading those stats, I would have been scared away. That did not stop Mary from pursuing the relationship with Sam, sharing intimate messages along with seductive photos. Mary often left loving messages for Sam, like this one. Maybe I'm out of class. Um, give me a call, okay? All right, I love you, bye. 200 plus voicemails from Mary to Sam. Sam was able to obtain photos of Mary inside her home by posing as Lindsay, Sam's friend who wanted to be a LuLaRoe consultant. After six months of this relationship, Mary discovered that Sam and his online persona was actually a woman named Jackie Overton. Understandably, Mary was very upset about the deception. She thought she was going to have a way out of her loveless marriage and into the arms of this handsome businessman that appears to be perfect in every way. Mary broke it off with the online catfisher. The catfisher then went on to monetize from this relationship by writing a book, Almost Married, and four months later followed up with a second book, Almost Defamed, Life After a Public Scandal. Sam Cooper continues to run his blog post at Not Batman Yet, with his most recent blog posted on February 2022. According to fans, Mary has continually posted cryptic messages on her Instagram, like her Instagram post, keep your face to the sunshine and you cannot see the shadows, which is by Helen Keller. Another post, she writes, they say to stay out of the weeds, to not get distracted by the little and unimportant things, to stay focused on your goal and your vision. Well, these are some weeds that I can get behind, weeds and surroundings that bring peace and promote focus. So I guess be sure to pick the right weeds with the little smiley face she posted. For the time she posed in her shirt that read, you do you boo. Then there was the Instagram post wearing a shirt that says, well, that didn't go as planned. And she asked in her post if anyone could relate. Are these all hidden messages giving the fans clues into the show? Is she actually planning on leaving? What about this post? Life isn't about finding yourself. Life is about creating yourself by George Bernard Shaw, where Mary posted her comment, which stated in part, that's what I want to do moving forward. Create me, create my environment. Is this a hidden message, meaning she will be leaving Cody? Her hashtags were living my way and because I can. After reading through many of the cryptic messages, I am asking, are we the ones being catfished? Into thinking that she has this very interesting life and is going to take action and actually leave Cody after the years of terrible abuse he's been putting her through? Ish just baiting us so that we follow her and maybe buy some of her Lula leggings? Who has been catfishing who? 
If you look at other LuLaRoe retailers, they post very similar social media posts on their pages. I am beginning to think that the catfish has turned into the catfisher, trying to fish us into her life that she shows as amazing and fun. Seems that Mary is not hinting at anything about the show. She is just looking for financial gain by promoting her LuLaRoe clothing business. Let's keep sipping some tea together, besties, in these videos.